it, it doesn't need to be big. Are you excited to see a new city? Good morning. Welcome back to Coffee and Tea Time. Cling, cling. We finally made to match it up. The full transparency. This is a smoothie in here, but I put matcha in my smoothie, so all is well. I still have coffee. We are in the car because... We are heading to Stockholm. The capital of Sweden. We made a pact this year that we're going to try to get away every month for a little getaway. Every month. That means 12 getaways this year. We'll see how it goes. It, it doesn't need to be big. It just needs to be somewhere else that's not our apartment just to see something new. And this time we're bringing our little pup Callie with us. She's like, okay, put me down. <laughs> she was concerned we were leaving without her. We even showed her how we were packing her stuff, but she was like, Blue skies, we're hoping it stays that way. The weather forecast told us differently, but... We believe in good driving weather. Are you ready to be in the car for five hours? With you, always. Best driver, best friend, best everything. Best navigator. It's one road, it's one highway. Real hard. We all have our strengths. strengths. We're also going to Stockholm to see if maybe this is somewhere that we would like to move to. As you all know, we're in the process of finding a house, so it's important that we check out all areas of the country because it's very unknown territory to me. We should probably get on the road now, shouldn't we? On the road again. See you in a bit. Bye. So we literally made it 30 minutes, I think, before having to stop and go to the bathroom. It was. Yeah, literally 30 minutes. Solid. The blue sky is gone. So sad. And we're switching because I have a feeling it's going to rain. And I'm not up for driving in the rain. Are you ready to go to Stockholm? Are you excited to see a new city? All good? Yeah. How are your blisters? I'll be fine, one day at a time. Will has like two horrible blisters on the back of his feet because he walked around in brand new Doc Martens for two hours. Not to be recommended, listen, <laughs> not to be recommended. number two we're about two hours into the drive but we also needed gas so that's a good excuse to stop be right back so much better literally the biggest relief is going to the bathroom when you're on a road trip <laughs> okay waiting for pairing oh Paired. i actually don't really want you to pair it's our friend lucy's birthday so we're just gonna call her really quick tell her happy birthday Let's see if she answers she probably won't oh, you want to say happy birthday she didn't answer, so sad. The best part about these gas stations is that some of them have Wi-Fi, so when we stop, I can quick log on to the Wi-Fi, check my email, and so on. It's handy for me, because I normally don't have Wi-Fi if like we're on the road, because I don't have a Swedish SIM card yet. It's a whole thing, so I either have to use Will's hotspot or connect to free Wi-Fi, like this. Do you feel better? I do feel better. We were just saying earlier how important it is to like take care of this time in Europe and visit many places. Okay. As you talk about how easy it is to travel around in Europe, I don't think it's as easy as everybody says, but we're trying to do that while we're here. Because in a couple years, when we live in America, we're gonna be really sad that we didn't do it. <laughs> It's a whole project if you travel from America to Europe. Well, if you travel within Europe, it's just way easier. That is true. It is easier. Like, we're driving right now to Stockholm, which is pretty cool, I must say. Um, I tried to call Lucy, but she didn't answer. Because they have Wi-Fi here. I love gas stations that have Wi-Fi. Not the TikTok. I don't know. Everybody told us we had to do TikTok, so now I'm just doing it, and I literally don't know what I'm doing. All right, what do we have? Three hours left? Two I hours? Think, I think three hours. That's doable. Three hours and three minutes. See you later. It is lunchtime in the car. This is our go-to road trip lunch. Pasta salad with vegetables. It's easy to eat, it's easy to prep, and it's delicious. It is one of the best things with road trips. We haven't had it since our US road trip though because we got so sick of it. We had it a million times. Our third and final stop, hopefully. We have about 30 minutes left of our drive. We only stopped three times. I think you could say that we did good, right? Oh my gosh, why is my brush not in my backpack? That's 
so upsetting. I desperately need to brush my hair, but I guess I'll have to wait because I don't feel like going to get it. Everything just feels dry in the winter. Oops, my hands, my face. Callie, how you doing, baby? I love you. She has been so good. She's slept pretty much the whole way. She's a little confused on where we're going because sometimes she stays with Will's parents when we go away for a weekend. I think the last time she traveled was back from America. Callie's like, where is my treat? I deserve a treat. Callie, what did he get you, Callie? What is that? Like, yes, I will take that. Thank you. I haven't had one all day. Shall we get back on the road? Yes, we shall. We got 30 minutes away, which is good. Easy. We can do that. Easy. Let's go. All right. Last strut. My gosh, we made it to the place where we're parking our car. However, the place where we're parking our car is not Stockholm. It is Stockholm, but it's not our hotel. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> He's like, what do you mean we're not we're not staying here? Oh, I love you, little one. So now we get to walk to the bus stop, and then we're gonna take a bus to the train, and then we're no. gonna walk from the train to the no, bus. No, we're 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 walking to the train station, which is literally ten minutes away. Take the train for nine minutes, and then we're in central Stockholm. This is literally the biggest struggle of our lives when we travel, except for <laughs> the last time we said this. So that's the biggest struggle of our life when we travel. The fact that Will does not want to take the car. <sighs> We have family friends that are generous enough to offer a parking spot for us. Yes. Just outside of town, yes. for free. Yes. The hotel's parking is $65 a night. You're like... Don't sass me. <laughs> I want to spend that on vegan food, okay? We got a long way to go, so we'll check back in. Public transportation, here we go. <laughs> Jokes. We got a handicap room, so it's a little bit more spacious, which is nice. The best lighting is in the bathroom. <laughs> but yeah, we made it. We checked in. Super nice hotel. Yay. I love the shower head. Kelly, were you hungry? and some takeout food. Kelly, look at this food. Doesn't it look yummy? Yum, yum. We're gonna have some dinner here and call it a night. Yeah. This is the end of the video. More exploring tomorrow. Tune in next time. For some <laughs> Stockholm content, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, we appreciate every single one of you. See you next time. When we get on the open road. Why is that sign on? I don't know what that means. Hopefully this is nothing serious. <laughs>